Next week is National Volunteer Week, and NBC4 found a woman who encourages others to give of themselves. This 80-year-old woman has been making a trip to the hospital a little less intimidating for the past two decades. Mindy Dreyer shares her story. You're going to go to cardiovascular, I understand. Yes. Okay. Go this way. Once a week, every week, Emma Tackett comes here to St. Anne's Hospital in Westerville to volunteer her time. I meet people and I love it. I walk them everywhere in the hospital. I don't tell them, turn left here, go right down here, turn. I take them. And she does it with such compassion. Emma is just an electric personality. A lot of people who come into the hospital uh, have a high anxiety level, might not be at ease, and I think she does a really good job of making our patients feel comfortable. Those patients and even the doctors look forward to seeing Emma. She's been here for nearly 25 years. And you got to have a positive attitude in life. Don't be so serious. You don't want to be serious. You want to have fun. And that's just not how Emma is here at the hospital. That's how she's been her entire life. And guess how old she is. I'm 80 years old. I don't think I believe you. Well, that's just the way it is. I don't believe it either. <laughs> Emma feels great and looks even better. She credits a lot of that to her husband of 60 years. He treats me like a lady. He makes me feel important. And he takes care of me. I love her. You have to be, have to love someone to take care of them. And when you marry them, you marry them for death do us part. These two not only love one another, they love life and never seem to worry about anything. There's too many big things ready to jump on your shoulders. Don't sweat the little ones. Thank you, honey. Great advice for all of us. Mindy Dreyer, NBC4. Welcome back. In our Sunday chat this week, we all know people who go out of their way to just make other people feel better. They're always happy. You just can't seem to bring them down no matter what. I recently had the privilege and honor to meet a woman from Sunbury who lights up any room that she walks into. And after you watch this morning Sunday chat, I'm sure you'll agree. This young lady is definitely worth talking about. Her name is Emma Tackett. First thing we have to tell everybody just how old you are. I'm 80 years old. I don't think I believe you. Mindy, I don't believe it either. <laughs> I, I really don't believe it either. How'd I get here? I tell the kids that all the time. How'd I get 80? 80? I always think of old people. <laughs> and I don't feel old. <laughs> and your birthday is 12, 13, 14. So That's on December right. 13th of last year is mm -hmm. when you turned 80. That's right. Oh, what's your secret? Like I say so many times, I'm just sort of a happy person, and I'm married to a wonderful husband of 60 years, and he treats me like a lady. He makes me feel important, and he takes care of me, and he always tells me how pretty I look. But you are beautiful <laughs> inside and out. I have a very positive attitude about life. I, I just enjoy people. I enjoy laughing. Enjoy basketball. <laughs> How many kids do you have? Uh, I have uh, four kids, and six grandchildren, and four great-grandchildren. Oh, I bet they just adore you. Well, they just think I'm one of the crowd, one of the kids. I don't think they think I ever grew up. <laughs> You've been a volunteer here at St. Anne's Hospital in Westerville for nearly 25 years. That's right. Mm -hmm. So you get to meet people, though, every day. You I meet, meet people, people, and I love it. I walk them everywhere in the hospital. I don't tell them, turn left here, go right down here, turn. I take them, and we talk. And if they're upset or in a bad mood, by the time I get them there, they're laughing. How has society changed in the years that you grew up to what it is A now? lot. Um, without being critical of anybody, I can't believe some of the things that do go on. They don't believe in the values anymore. A lot of people don't, not everybody, but a lot of people don't believe in the values. So I have to ask you, what is your advice? Because everyone would love to live as long as you and look as great as you. Well, you know, I don't do anything hardly at all for appearance. I really don't. I buy inexpensive uh, cream and makeup at the drugstore or the uh, supermarket. Um, I wash my face at night in, in soap and water, put a little cream on. When I get up in the morning, 
I splash my face with as cold as I can get with ice water. Just splash real cold water. That's it. But attitude is everything. And you got to have a positive attitude in life. Don't be so serious. You don't want to be serious. You want to have fun. There's too many big things ready to jump on your shoulders. Don't sweat the little ones. Just don't sweat those little ones. And it doesn't cost anything to smile. You loved her, didn't you? I did. How can you not? Emma Tackett, you are fabulous. I still would like to see a birth certificate because I cannot believe she's 80.